welcome back to Grace's room. So online schooling started for me again last week and it was a little bit of a busy week and I didn't really have a lot of time to film some sort of extravagant video. But I was cleaning up my closet a few days ago and I thought to myself, I've never actually shown you guys like a like a full closet tour, like showing, taking you guys through like my entire closet. And so I thought that'll be a really fun video to film today. Um, I've got three closets here and I think I'll start off with this one here. This year has mainly got like all like my accessories in it, but I also have a few drawers and some clothes in it too. I'll start off with the drawers. Here I've just got a lot of undergarments and I don't think you really want to see that, so I'm just going to skip past that drawer. But here I've got all of my pants and my shorts. These two rows here are all my pants and these two rows here are all my shorts. Um, I got all like all my jeans here and my favorite pair of jeans is probably this one, these ones here, you've probably seen me wearing them a lot, like on my Instagram and even my videos. They're from Ellie Fashion, they're just these really cute, like light blue ripped jeans and I always wear them, they're just so pretty, they feel like they go with everything. Um, and I kind of feel like I'm wearing them out a little bit, so I might need to get a second pair of those. Oh, you've also seen I do like my little Marie Kondo set out here. Um, these pants here I got in, in Barcelona, I think, and I have absolutely no idea why I wanted them so bad you might have seen I think I did an Instagram post wearing them once but I've only wore them worn them like that one time and I never wore them again I don't know I just I just want the most attractive things <laughs> but hopefully maybe they come back in fashion so I can wear them again <laughs> uh, and then here I've got all of my shorts like I said these are all like my blue denim shorts and then these are all like my black denim shorts um, these here you might remember from my tie-dye video. Um, I can't wait for it to be summer so I can actually wear them and see if like, they will look good and if I can actually like, pair them with some outfits. Um, but here I've also got like these really cute like comfortable pair of shorts. These are definitely my favourites. This is definitely one of my favourites. Um, they're from Alessi and they're just so comfortable to wear around the house. Even going out sometimes too. But yes, this is my pants drawer. And so for the next drawer, I've got um, it's just some like random things. I've got like my swimwear, some like sporting clothes, like some like workout clothes, I mean, some like old things like, you know, like to put on like when you go to the pool or like to the beach. And then I've also got all of like my baseball caps here. This one is definitely my favorite. Um, this is the San Francisco Giants hat and I got it when I went to go see the San Francisco Giants play when I went to San Francisco in 2017, I'm pretty sure. And I was really excited to get this hat. I wore it like all throughout the trip. And when we went to LA, I lost it on the Space Mountain ride and I was so devastated. But I think after a few hours, we finally found it in one of the carriages and I was so happy. But yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite hats. It's a little bit small for me though, so. Um, back here, I have my old ballet shoes that I wore when I was like three years old and I used to do ballet. They're very dirty. I didn't expect them to be this dirty, but it was a cute little memory that I wanted to keep. Um, here, like I said, I've got all my swimwear. This is probably my favorite pair of bathers. I know it still has a tag on it and I only got them recently. Um, I only got them like just when summer finished so I was very disappointed I couldn't wear them in the pool but I definitely know that these would probably be my favorite I love them so much it's like so pretty but yeah this drawer used to always be a mess and so when I finally cleaned it out I was so happy with how I sorted everything but yes this next drawer has got all of like my shoes I've got some runners some sandals and like some heels in here these here are probably like my favorite slippers they're a little bit small for me now they're like these shopkin ones but it's so cute when you wear them and every time that you take a step, the ears pop up. Like, how cute is that? I could not bring myself to get rid of these, so I wanted to keep them even they're a little bit small for me. Here, I've got like my Doc Martens. These are probably like my favorite pair of shoes. Um, I wore them, I've been wearing them a lot throughout like winter, even though we can't really go out a lot, but they're just so comfortable and they go with a lot of outfits. This is like a really old pair of superstars. They're like pink, but like I didn't really wear them a lot and I didn't really want to get rid of them even though, again, they're still a little bit small for me, but I really like them. Oh, and here I've also got the um, the custom Air Forces that I did. You might've seen my video for that, um, but I haven't really worn them a lot because I'm so scared that I'm going to ruin them, but I really like those. So 
that's my shoe drawer. Let's go on to these shelves here that have got like most of like my accessories. Perfume is definitely one of my favorite beauty products. I love it so much. Um, here I've got displayed neatly all of my perfumes. Um, this is like the very first perfume I ever got. I think I got it like in 2013, I'm pretty sure. It's this Katy Perry Pur perfume and I mean, how cute is the bottle? And I'm really bad at describing scents, but it smells like so nice. And this one here is probably like my favorite perfume. It's from Kim Kardashian. It's called the Kimoji Cherry. I can't describe, it's like a bit, little bit like vanilla-y, but it's just so pretty. And again, like look at this bottle, how cute is that? <laughs> Back here I've got all my body sprays. I love Bath & Body Works body sprays as you can probably tell. I also like the Victoria's Secret ones as well. I have one of these in my lockers at school. I'm obsessed with them. Um, this one's probably my favourite. It's a very recent one but it smells really nice. I, Like I said I can't really describe the scent but it's this desert wildflower thing but it's just, it just smells so good and I use it all the time. I've got some like Bath & Body Works moisturisers back here. A little mirror. And also some deodorants and just another little box that has more like sample perfumes and like some roll-on ones that I usually like to take around with me or put in like my bag. So this next shelf here, I've got all of my bags. This is probably my favorite one. It's from Michael Kors, but it's just like, it's just such a good like travel bag. Like I always take, if I go away, I'll always bring this bag or if I'm just going to the shops, I'll bring this bag. It's just such a handy bag. Here I've got like my little purses. Um, this is another Michael Kors one. It's definitely my favorite. It's my spin, like, like matches my shoes. It's just such a pretty purse. I just love the color. I love like when you guys might remember like purple used to be my favorite color, but light pink. If you can tell from like the theme of my room, light pink is definitely the new color that I love. It's just so pretty. Um, I've got my little MJ figure over there. <laughs> um, I usually like to keep like. You know how like some stores they have like really cute shopping bags like Sephora and Mecca? I like to collect some of them and, keep, and I put them in this bag here just because I don't really want to get rid of them. Um, here I've got my Instax camera and I've, this is just a little like photo um, album that I kept that have like some really old photos. And <laughs> um, I've got my camera in here. But this is that's pretty much all for this shelf here. This one I finally cleaned out. It was so messy and it looks a little bit neater now, or maybe a little bit cluttered, but oh well. Um, I have like my piggy bank, like an old makeup box, megaphone, <laughs> this old like Zoe but makeup bag. I also have my Rubik's Cube here. I'm in the middle of solving it. Um, this here is my old, this is the very first camera I ever got. It's just a really cute hot pink Canon camera and it still works like at brand new and I found the char charger for it the other day and I found some really cute like old photos that I took on it was very funny oh and I can't forget this I got so distracted on us cleaning out my closet just going through this entire book but I got it when I went to Disneyland for the very first time in 2011 and I just had some like little photos of me like look how cute James was that was with Ariel but yeah, I've just got like lots of photos of some of the Disney characters and their signatures, but love this book. And then lastly, at the very top, I've just got some old stuffed animals, pillows, and just some little knickknacks. So yes, that is the first cupboard, probably the most interesting one. It's definitely my favorite. Um, this next one here, I've got all of like the clothes, my hanging clothes. Um, they're probably more like my formal outfits. Here I've got like my skirts, um, they're like kind of sorted like from colour as well because I'm just really particular with like sorting out everything from like colour order and like fancy order if that makes sense. Um, I've got like my black denim skirts here, I really like like the gingham, the gingham, is that you say it? The gingham style and um, like these plat plaited ones as well. This is like kind of reminds me of like clues, so I got it from Pull & Bear in Europe. But it's so pretty. I wore this a few times in summer and it's just a really cute skirt. Uh, this one here I got from Supreme. and it's like a really nice one for winter as well because usually you don't really wear skirts in winter obviously because it's cold but this is like a really nice one. It kind of reminds me of like a winter skirt too. But that's pretty much all from like my skirts. Most of them are probably like from Glassons but yes I love wearing skirts in summer. Here I've got all of like my fancier t-shirts and just normal like sleeveless ones. This one I got like from Forever 21 and it's like 
I got it like a while ago, like in Hawaii, but it's just like such a pretty like off the shoulder one, like flowers and stuff on it. I've worn it def definitely worn it a lot. This one I only got like just this summer, but it's such a pretty top. It has like a little tie on it and it kind of goes with like a lot of like things. Like I even wore it a few times like in autumn as well, but it's just really pretty. I love the colors. I've got all my black t-shirts here. Um, these are like more like my long sleeve ones. I have no idea what I was thinking when I bought this one, but it was a, it was a while ago, so forgive me, but it still fits me to this day, but it's definitely not one of my favorites. <laughs> it's a little bit, pretty festive. <laughs> I should wear it for Christmas. Um, oh, this one here I got like a while ago from Bardo Jr. And it's just this really cute like fluffy jumper and I really don't want to like get rid of it. It still fits me perfectly, so there's no reason to, but it's very fluffy and I've definitely worn it a few times. One of my favorites. Um, my favorite like long sleeve formal top is definitely this one from Tiger Mist. It's like, this, sorry, I didn't really hang it up properly, but it's like this off the shoulder, really cute like long sleeve black top and I love wearing it, it's so pretty. And then lastly for this first section, I've got my jumpers. This one is another San Francisco Giants one that I've been wearing a lot during isolation. It's so comfortable. But this is like the smallest size that they had, so I think this will last me for a very long time. <laughs> oh, this one here. I forgot to mention, I have like all my posters here. Like I've got like my Jughead one and I took this one with KJ Apper who plays Archie in Riverdale in 2017 or 2018 maybe when I went to Comic-Con. And this is one of the jumpers that I got from Comic-Con. It was like this, it's this Riverdale Southside Serpents one. It says it on the back too, and I was very excited when I first got this. <laughs> but it's very comfortable as well. And then this one I got from the outlets in Hawaii. And I only just started wearing it like a lot more like recently. But it's like really pretty. I like the tie up here. And the good thing is it's kind of a little bit fancier as well, so I like to wear it when I go out. Okay, so that's like the first section. Then here I've got all my dresses, I've got all my school, my school uniform here, which we thankfully don't have to worry about at the moment while we're doing online schooling. But here I've got all my dresses. Again, they're sorted out from like black and colorful here. Um, this one I got in Rome, I'm pretty sure, from Guess. And I really want to wear it, but since we can't really go out at the moment, I have like nowhere to wear it. It's more of like a wintry dress, a bit more long sleeve, but it's very pretty. Um, I've just, yeah, got a lot of like, oh, this one here from Bardo Jr. It's like a, more like a halter dress, but it's like really pretty. I like the stripes and I used to wear it like a lot, but I haven't really worn it recently. Obviously because of the weather. This one from Nike I can't wait to wear in summer. It's so pretty. It's like, I don't know what kind of skirt dress it is, but it's really pretty. <laughs> and then here, I've, like I said, I've got more of my colorful things. Oh, I also have some dresses here that I really didn't want to get rid of. They're like some ones from my childhood. This is like this hot pink one that I used to always wear. It's so cute and I definitely didn't want to get rid of it. It was definitely my favorite one when I was like nine or something like that. And then this one here is like a Minnie Mouse dress, which is so pretty. I think I got this in Disneyland in 2011, I'm pretty sure. Oh, and this is one that I wore for my graduation, I'm pretty sure for um, primary school and it's so pretty and I didn't want to get rid of this one either. Oh, and this one here I got from like my cousin, like my older cousin, and I have no way to wear it. It's such like a long, pretty dress, but I like, I think it looks so cute though. So that's all for, oh, I want this one for Christmas this year, you might remember from my Instagram post. Um, but besides that, that's all for this cupboard here. Up here I've just got like my ring light and like some American Girl doll closets. It's all my American Girl doll clothes in there. And some uh, Barbie items like the cruise ship in a camper van that you might remember from my very first videos. Like the Barbie cruise ship adventure. That was the cruise ship that I used. So that's all for this cupboard. And now for the very last cupboard, I've just got some more clothes obviously. Up here I've got some more American Girl doll closets. Um, I had a lot of, I have a lot of American Girl doll clothes and so I just thought I'd put them in those closets and put them up there. Um, I've got some old Barbies in here, um, a Wally Wish doll from Amer American Girl and then this old like, keepsake box that I've just got like some kindergarten and baby photos and stuff like that in there. Um, here I've got my 
travel. Like my suitcase here has Minnie Mouse in it, which I probably won't be using for a very long time due to everything that's going on at the moment. Um, and I've just got all my jackets and like my dressing gowns here. This is a very recent dressing gown that I got. It's this really cute, like fluffy one, and it's so I love it. It's so comfortable. And this is the one that I used to wear. This fluffy one with clouds, but I really didn't want to get rid of it because I mean like how cute is it? Okay, so here I've got like all my denim jackets. This one here is from Spray. It's a really cute like just normal denim jacket. This one here is from Forever 21 that I got in Hawaii and it's such a pretty like light blue jacket. I love the flowers on it. I've got a blazer here. Um, yeah, and I just got like some cardigans. Oh, this one I got like in 2015, I think, when I went to New York. And um, we underestimated how cold it would be like during the night time. And so I had to get this from H&M because I was freezing. But I ended up like really liking it. So I've kept, I've kept it, but it's just like really short for me now. <laughs> That's the only thing. I don't want to get rid of it. Um, oh, this one I think I got, yeah, I got it in San Francisco again. A few little pieces of clothing from San Francisco. But again, I was cold because I didn't bring a jacket and um, I, I ended up getting this jacket and I really liked it, so I've kept it. And then this here is my Kathmandu jacket that I always like to bring out during winter. I think almost every single teenager girl in, uh, in Australia has this jacket, but it's really cute. <laughs> it's very comfortable. And then, oh, this here is my jacket. It's this jacket that I got um, from YouTube. It says Grace's World 2016 on the back. And it's this Adidas, like, tracksuit set. It has, like, some pants underneath it. But um, I wore this in a sibling rivalry, rival, rivalry. So I've been talking so much, I'm like, <laughs> but um, I, yeah, I don't really wear this a lot, but it's very cute. <laughs> And then lastly, I have this like really cute like grey cardigan, it's like a knitted thing. And it's really comfortable and I like to wear it a lot during winter as well. So now moving on to the drawers. This here is like my pyjama drawer. I've got like my long sleeve winter pyjamas here. This is like Kermit pyjamas that I wore all the time. And I didn't really want to get rid of them. I kind of just have them more as like a keepsake, but I used to wear them all the time. And I mean, how cute are they? Um, and this is probably my my summer pajamas here, and this is probably my favorite piece of summer pajamas. This is like a uh, it's a it's a Paris one, and I really like how it's light pink. It kind of matches the theme of my room. But that's all my pajamas. Probably not too interesting. Here I've got all of like my jumpers. Um, my my favorite jumper, I don't know, probably this one here from Nike. I've got Nike. Sorry, I always say Nike. It's just a habit now, but I know I'm pretty sure it's supposed to pronounce. Um, Nike, but this is just a really cute purple one that I got in Rome and I love wearing it. It's so comfortable too. It's like fluffy on the inside. And then, oh, I got I made this one when I was thrifting some of my mum's old clothes and I need to wear it, but it's like really cute. I cleaned up the bottom a little bit now, so it, it looks a lot better. I'll have to fold those later. <laughs> um, and then here is my very cluttered t shirt drawer, which is uh, very cluttered, like I said. It's um, I did it in like the whole Marie Kondo style. This is probably my favorite t shirt it's from Hard Rock. You've probably seen me wear it a lot, <laughs> but it just like says Venice on it and it's really cute. Um, I've got some more t shirts here. I really like this one too. It's from Pull and Bear. Definitely more of a summer top. It looks small, it looks really small, but once you put it on, it like stretches out a lot. Um, I've got like my tie-dye my tie-dye shirt back there and here I've just got more of like my like singlet crop top tops here um, This one here is from Glassons and it's so pretty. I wore it for New Year's Eve and it's like it's like knitted But it looks so cute on But yes, that's all of like my t-shirts Oh, I also like to sort it out in color order as well because as you can probably tell from all the clothes I like to sort them out in color order and then lastly I've just got like some random clothes like I have my old uniform from primary school that I didn't want to get rid of some floppy gloves leather gloves <laughs> um, I had this old American Girl doll top that I didn't want to get rid of just because like it was the very first piece of American Girl doll merch that I got and it doesn't fit me anymore but I thought it would just be really cute to keep and then I've just got this scarf as well which 
I mean, it's cute, but I don't really wear it a lot. <laughs> so, that is all for my closet tour. Those all three of my closets. Um, definitely gone a lot neater than it was before. Uh, but I had a lot of fun just going through that and kind of sharing a few little stories. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out my Instagram um, at Grace's World Official, and I'll see you guys next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now.